With Easel, you can easily create interactive activities that students can complete on any device. You can start by searching for Easel activities on TeachersPayTeachers.com. Or you can create your own content by going to the My Activities page. Once there, you can click Create to upload a PDF you own or have rights to use, or start an activity from scratch within Easel. When you open a resource on the My Activities page, you can click Edit Pages to add pages, remove pages, or import your own PDF to add to the resource. The annotation tools in Easel make it easy to customize your resource. Let's take a closer look at how you can use these tools. Want students to type something? Add an answer box. It will expand when needed and collapse when they're done. Only teachers can add answer boxes, not students. You can also use the text feature to add extra instructions, questions, or content to your activity. You can edit the font size, text color, and alignment as needed. If you select the text and click Movable, your students will be able to move the text around for labeling activities, sorting activities, and more. Movable text will have a green outline. Using the pen tool, you and your students can circle, underline, draw, and more. It's easy to edit the color and thickness to your liking. With the highlighter tool, you can annotate text, emphasize instructions, or indicate correct answers. Adjust the color and thickness to suit you. Let's check out the shape tool. You can use it to draw straight lines, circle answers, insert colorful shapes, and hide select content. Double click on a shape to add text and change the style and alignment of the text. Plus, you can edit the shape, color, and border style. You can also upload images to an easel activity. Drag and drop an image file or select one from your computer to upload it to the activity. Please make sure you're using images you have the rights to use. After inserting images and shapes, select them and click Movable to create all kinds of virtual manipulatives, sorting activities, and more. Students will be able to move the shapes and images, and you won't have to worry about them accidentally resizing or deleting them. Only teachers can do that. Movable shapes will have a green outline. With the delete button in Easel or the delete key on your keyboard, you can delete any element that you or a teacher author has added in Easel. Students, on the other hand, can only delete annotations they've added themselves. Note that elements in the background image can't be deleted. Want to preview what your students will see and experience when using your Easel activity? Click on the View as Student button. When you're ready, click the Assign and Review tab at top, and then the blue Assign button to share the activity via Google Classroom or generate a link to use on any learning management system. Thanks so much for watching. In the next video, learn how to use Easel as a digital whiteboard.